Hello and welcome to my home base Pottery Studio. I'm Joan and today we're gonna be working on the second half of the creation of the Japanese collection. So we're gonna be focusing ourselves on creating some glazes, formulating them, testing them and seeing if we like them or not. And then from those ones, we're gonna select the glazes, the final ones that we're gonna be using for the beast pottery. Yeah, basically we're gonna do a lot of glazing and a lot of discovering. I was really nervous during the process because you never know how it's gonna turn out even though you, you do a lot of test styles. You know, no, every single firing is a new experience and a new chance for magical things to happen. And sometimes we have some other times that are not that magical, but it's part of the process here in my studio and in poetry. If you are a potter, you know what I'm talking about. I hope you are excited. Let's go ahead and start glazing, cleaning the pieces, mixing some glazes, doing some formulation and and loading the piece firings that are the most exciting thing ever. So we're gonna discover the pieces that are gonna be available next Friday, uh, the 20th of September at half past eight, Central Euro European summer time. And yeah, I cannot wait to, to share all those pieces with you. So have fun, enjoy, see you at the end of the video. Wow. So we are back and today we're gonna be piece firing all those base bees, all those base bees, all those base bees, wow, all those babies <laughs> that you see in here. I have also some plates up there that I didn't place on the table and also test, test, whatever, I don't know how they are called in English, but bases that I'm gonna be using for me to test the glass, for me to taste the glazes and see if they work out with the new pieces because we have the white clay but also we have the Berlin, I think it's called. It's a new one I've never tried. I'm preparing new glazes for this collection. If they work out, otherwise I'm not having new glazes. <laughs> I'm really excited and happy to see all these babies. We're gonna go ahead and just load the kill. Easy peasy, fast and easy. <laughs> Sorry, my brain is just all over the place. We're in a round. For you to call back Pacing around My room and my dad Crazy, crazy I want you to know What you have against me The city is not The place for us to be Cause I'm trying to figure out why you hate me? Was it something I did? Yeah, I don't need to offend I'm just waiting I'm just waiting Because of all of the lies Yeah, you don't need to disguise Your face Your face I just want you to know That I am rooting for you It's okay It's okay Oh, 
Thursday and I'm back in the studio. Today we're gonna be unloading the kiln and we're gonna be creating a lot of new uh, glazes. I'm really excited. I'm gonna be showing you later on the process of making the textiles. At the beginning of August I started a course of chemistry of glazes and really motivated because I want to mix some of the recipes that I got in that workshop and make my own. We're gonna have new glazes if everything goes fine, new glazes for this new collection. We're gonna be moving here uh, and unloading the, the kiln together. You, you and me. Okay, vale, vamos. Let me bring you closer. Good morning! So we are back. As you saw previously, I was preparing the glazes that we're gonna be firing today. And yeah, I didn't record the whole process because it was just about repeating over and over the same thing. Just weighting the materials and the oxides. Oxides? I don't know, maybe they are called like this. The studio is really messy. Today we're gonna be just going through the glazes and I'm gonna be just like smoothing out the surface, getting rid of any bubbles or imperfections and then we're gonna fire the test tiles and we'll see on Monday the results and depending on these results I'm gonna decide how will the new pieces be glazed. I'm gonna be just going through the glazes and cleaning the whole studio I have. Well I'm gonna be showing you is a mess. All the ingredients ingredients all over. I need to wear the mask again because yeah like the powder of the glazes is the worst thing you can inhale and also I need to clean the pottery wheel so it's gonna be lovely. It's the kind of day I don't enjoy much but I think it's gonna be needed and it's gonna help me also to cleanse. <laughs> I'm gonna show you the mess we have in the studio. Like my studio is not always clean, it's always 
a bit messy, but you know what? This is a studio that means to be used and messed around, so yay! First area, we need to clean and organize. More mess and more mess. We are gonna go through the glazes. I'm gonna just smooth out the small bubbles we have on the surface of the test tails and I'm gonna be loading them. I also loaded uh, some pieces from my friends that they came one afternoon and we were doing some stuff that I'm gonna show you later on. It's really cute. And then later on we're gonna be firing. Ah! Next time we're gonna discover the glaze together and yeah, I'm really excited, so, so excited for what is to come. Hopefully something positive uh, or glazes that we like, enjoy, because for sure it's going to be something positive because I'm going to learn something out of it. But I hope and I, I'm, I'm waiting, I'm looking for the next glazes that I'm going to be using for the Japanese inspired collection. So yeah, hopefully those glazes are going to come out of the test we were doing yesterday night and we were doing also in the workshop that i was taking earlier this month that was amazing so let's 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 go let's make it together and first of all So I'm back and we are going to be loading the glaze firing, the tests I have done the other day and we'll see. Wow, I'm excited. Let's go find out. Kind of thought she was into me, but I Love turning friends into enemies now 
Stop. Rock. 
it's the moment of truth and we are gonna be unloading the first glaze firing of this new Japanese collection with the new glazes. I'm freaking out. Uh, I was on the metro and I was just like really nervous. So I arrived here and I had to do an exercise of controlling myself because my SD card from the camera was full so I needed to transfer all the files to my laptop so I had to wait an extra 25 minutes here in the studio knowing that I have the pieces already ah, <laughs> fired and well um let's go let's 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 discover um let's see if they made it through let's see if they made it through <laughs> We have unloaded the uh, glaze firing and we have the new batch of pieces with the darker glazes that I'm gonna be using because I still need to glaze half of them, maybe a tiny bit less of half, but uh, definitely is a few more. But we have the first results that I'm gonna be sharing with you. We have this green, dark deep green, we have this deep green 
that inside is having a tiny bit of different effects. We also have another dark glaze which is really shiny. Yes, those This one is quite uh, deep, it's quite a deep color, is I would say, look, that's the color of the piece. You can see inside of the this glaze, inside of the mugs that I have used and glazed this specific one, you can find this um, effect. So we have this other glaze that depending on the placement of the piece you're gonna see that is uh, greener or is having more the speckles. Yes, there we go. So depending on the placement of the piece you're gonna have one side that it has this um, coloration and the other side that is not exposed to that much of uh, heat somehow is having more like a green
We have all the pieces loaded and we started firing the last clay firing of the collection that we're gonna see, well, I'm gonna see on Monday and we're, you're gonna see later on. But if you wanna be updated, you can also follow me on my Patreon. You can find on my bio all the links. I'm, I'm gonna link it on the description of the video. And in there, I'm gonna be posting the results of the last pieces that we have loaded now. Also, you can follow me on my Instagram and TikTok, also with the name of Taramida. And in there, you're gonna get all the updates and you're gonna see some other stuff from me. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and love you. Thank you for spending time with me and see you next time. Let's see how it goes. Fingers crossed that they survive. Bye. Have a good one. Have a good, beautiful day, a beautiful weekend, a beautiful week, a beautiful life. Bye.